Have a good drive, you guys. This is the true Millie Millie. Ten, Brescia, Italy, the Mille Miglia. It's cold and windy and rainy. A few cars showing up. And because of that wet and windy weather, a lot of cars have already arrived. And this is the scrutineering or registration and scrutineering area. It's a large fair building outside of Brescia. Now this event is sponsored by Mercedes, but BMW has a strong presence here. And of course, just a lot of really great cars. I mentioned BMW's presence. Well, the 550 Spider qualifies Porsche. And a gorgeous Maserati Coupe. And a gorgeous Citroën 2CV. <laughs> Same color. Now this came in earlier. It's a little Fiat derivation. Delage. Here's my dream car. Here's the Ferrari that was stolen in the year 2000, the Millimillion. It's all been brought back. It's a 340mm. It's really great to see this car again. The oldies but the goodies. Launch you. Seattle Grand Sport. Alfa Romeo. Now here is one of the new Ferrari cars, the new um, Italia. Maserati. Ferrari. Good variety here this morning, C-Type Jaguar. Now how's this? This is a trailer queen. Come on. Fraser Nash. Making a grand entry. Mercedes sponsors this show, for this program, and there are a lot of gold wings, no question about it. F40, Ferrari. Right after that, look at here. Stanga. Hi, <laughs> Stanga. Whoa, 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 whoa! 550. Alfa Romeo. Huge. Ferrari Tour de France. Now, this Belila has been in a few millimillions, it looks like to me. All right, this is a 1933 Fiat, but look at the modern age as far as handling the rain in the Millimilia. Lancia. C-Type. Jaguar. Well, with all the bravado, he conks the engine out. All right, here we go. Nice car. And, uh, ooh, Lagonda? Hi. That's good. A little windy. Riley. The real Millie. Auto Vu. Fiat V8. I'll uh, say Goldwing three times. And then Jaguar. The heavy irons here too. 
Now that one back there was authentic and real used, but look at this one here. It's in the showroom, showroom condition. The spirit of the millimillia. The spirit. Elegance at the millimillia. BMW museum car. It's a replica of one of their early race cars. If you want contrast in automobiles, you come to the Millimillia. All right, here's a 550 Porsche and a Cooper Jaguar. A lot of Porsches this year. Nothing like a gull wing with Rudge knockoff wheels. Now here is a very impressive view. The gathering of all these cars is just fantastic. Arnold Bristol. Here's how you handle the rain. Remember when they used to call an MG a midget? Well, there is a midget right there, MG, wow. Now this may be, well, a rally, and it could be a Riley. Ferrari, uh, 166. Maybe bigger, who knows? Fun and games, in the rain. Boy, a lot of sea types this year. Well, some cars come on trailers, others come on on their own. Mexican road race Ferrari. Oh, this is the Speaking of Mexican road race, it's the Mexican road race Mercedes-Benz. Some arrived by trailer. Whoa, the wind is getting me here. Anyway, Aston Martin. There's a big Ferrari demonstration this year, about 150 Ferraris. And there's an F50, we saw an F40 earlier. Emil car. Uh, I gotta figure, you got a thousand miles in this, so I hope it makes it. About a 55, 56 Porsche. You don't see that many F50s these days. Just very rare. With a nice tidy top of this rainy day. Another D-type. <laughs> OM. First car to win the Millimilia was built in Brescia, and that was an OM. Feel it. Now what is this? What is this? What is this? Porsches. Whoa! And they just keep going around. Incredibly rare Italian car. Big Alfa Romeo coming in on a trailer. And this is a Seattle. Aston Martin. Porsche, a union. Another C-type. Pininfarina Ferrari. Well, 100 years of Alfa Romeo. It's a six-cylinder. A 1934 or five, maybe? Aston Martin. Oh. Save me, save me. Oh, what a great car. A lot of trailers and a few queens. Oh, look at this Ferrari. Oh, I want it. Vignali, super. Then there are moments when these cars come out of the truck. It's Alfa Romeo, sensational, sensational. Oh, 100th anniversary Alfa there. Oh, look at that. Ready for the Millimilia. AC Ace. Alfa Romeo. Beautiful. In for a landing. Ha. This is 
is an Alfred Mayo museum car, I think. Six cylinder. Delivered. Another little Fiat derivation. Aerodynamic. Lancia Aurelia. Again, one of those Ferrari Italias. Totally different in white. My goodness. White Lancia, and look at here, is one of the new. This is part of that Ferrari parade this year. That's the new Italia. Oh, the variety. Eight cylinder. Oops, 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 oops. Contrast, contrast. Mercedes and a little Fiat. Have you ever seen a truck hatch so many beautiful cars? These are from the Alpha Museum. All gonna drive in the Mille Millie this year. Oh, look at this. Out for scrutineering. All right, here's one. Was it Villa Deste? I say one because we're getting into scrutineering now. Looking very much like a Ferrari, which it is not. This is a Fiat derivation. Fiat Aerodynamica. Aston Martin. I said it before, the Bugatti people had the best time here. No, this is not a Bugatti. Sure neat though. 1940 BMW. Milla Milla winner. Now we have a bunch of Ferraris coming in that's going to be in the Ferrari parade, an F40. And an Enzo. Yeah. Yeah. Another Enzo. Another. F40. Five fifty. Look here for the for the third year in a row. Ferrari one sixty six. The racers Ferrari. One hundredth anniversary of Alfa Romeo. I think you're going to see a lot of them this year. This is a one gorgeous two tone paint, big wheels, beautiful touring body. Yeah, an Alfa Romeo in Italy. What more do you want? Well, I'll tell you what you want. You want a Ferrari. And you're going to get one. Vignali. All right, now how about an Auto Vu? Eight cylinder Fiat. Yeah. We're getting them all in a row here. I tell you, these cars look good anywhere, even on a trailer. Like I said, they look good anywhere. A little bit of the fins. A lot of trailers this year. The Lancia Lambda. No, this is not the long wheelbase model, that's the way it is. Aston Martin. BMW. All right, I saw this Ferrari at Cavallino many years ago. Totally unrestored. It's the Marzotto Brothers. This was a wreck, a rolling wreck. Yep, this is one of those very rare cars, like one of one. It is sparse, strictly for racing. Look at the tire in the back. Unbelievable. A rare of rare. Quite a lineup this year. This is the Racers Ferrari. The movie The Racers. Much smaller engine than the one we saw earlier. One of my favorites. 
just a while ago, both of these cars came in a Ferrari Millimilia and an early Maserati and a bright Vignelli Ferrari. Vignelli. Now here's an Italian lineup. Alfa Romeo's. Earlier this came in and it's a Riley Ferrari. Vignelli. On Turing bodied Ferraris. This one is perfection. Mercedes. Skagliari design uh, four cylinder Ferrari. Well, we got the hood on it now, and now you can get it in its totality, and it's beautiful. Now, this is that Mar um, <laughs> Mexico Ferrari that Jack McAfee raced. All right, here's that one that was stolen in 2000. Just rebuilt. Fabulous. And they're bringing the cars up for the line for scrutineering. Just a moment ago, you saw that silver and red one, which was stolen. Well, <laughs> you know, here's a one that's by Vignelli again. It's just a little bit bigger. Once earlier today, we showed a couple of very large Mercedes. Here's the third one. Interesting rear ends. Almost all the cars are here, supposedly. So here's the Expo Center at about quite a gathering. Impressive one this year as well. 6.45 in the morning. In the garage in Brescia. Ready to start the Millimilli today. Oh yeah, there's other kinds in the event. Time for breakfast in Brescia. Can you believe it? S Seven o'clock in the morning, first car. Oh, what a day. Let's hope it's going to be no rain. Well, the second car has arrived. Beautiful Alfa Romeo. Now the people that really are serious about the Millimilia have serious equipment attached to their windshield, dashboard. This happens to be the one that won last year. This personifies this event. Here's a red English car in Italy, driven and owned, I presume, by Italians. It's an Aston Martin. Now maybe there's a 500 Amelia touring. There's all kinds of celebration that goes on in Italy here, and here's one of them. A car represents another event. You know, Cinquecento, 500. <clears throat> maybe they were only for these cars. Looks pretty serious though. One of the first cars has arrived, looking very Ferrari-ish. It's a Fiat. It's been in the Mille Amelia before, but it's a very interesting car. As you can see by the reflections, we have blue sky today. All right, BMW's getting their cars ready for, you know, early morning publicity, I presume. Still great to see them, though. Well, I have being told to line up with the rest of the cars, I guess. Yes, it's a Fiat as well. Okay, they're going to try it again. Make a formal approach here. I do it over and over again until they get it right. Oh, this time it looks... Well, they're <laughs> going back to the garage. A lot of red cars. British cars at that. Again, a red British car in Italy, driven by Italians. I mentioned that all kinds of cars entered the Millimilli are entered, and here is the contrast. The Turian 2CV. Oscar. Oh, he thinks he's gonna get by. It ain't gonna happen. Now park it right here. Fiat Belila showing up. Even the smallest show up. She's Italian. Another red English car in Italy. It 
That's a very long wheelbase, Aston Martin. All right, some early morning drama here. Here's the 1951 winning Ferrari. The Millimilia. And just like the Millimilia, parting the crowds. Alfa Romeo. And even the speedsters welcome. Aravu. Fiat V8. This is the first escorted group of cars from the uh, fairgrounds where we saw them yesterday. Maserati. All right, now we got a prize Ferrari coming up here. Ferrari. Mercedes. Getting red and exciting. Now this is an OM, one of the cars built here in Brescia. Now this is called a SAM. And probably the smallest car in a Millimilia. Danga. Getting a lot of attention is this BNC. Salvo, a green one at that. A Belila, Fiat, 1934 or 5. A Zagato, Auto Vu. Alfa Romeo. Aston Martin. Another Auto Vu. Now a green, maybe it's another Taubo. Alfa Romeo. Huge car! Mercedes. And the ground thunders. Lagonda. Now, here's a green car in Italy. English car, driven by Italians. Fiat Multipla. Living from the past. 2008, what is this? Fiat. MG. Delahaye, Bentley, I believe, Alfa Romeo, Aston Martin, Porsche, Ferrari. Alfa Romeo. Two kinds of horsepower. Again, parked on the streets, not even in the Millimilli. Here's this little Fiat. And here is an entrance. She's Italian. Just innocently parked here on the streets. Little Fiat derivation. Only in Italy, only at the Millimilli. Why you got the new Ferraris? Alfa Romeo, these are from the museum, I think. Aurelia. This is the logo of Alfa Romeo's 100th anniversary. Russia. The Millimilia. Fabulous Alfa Romeo. Oh, the, the crowd. Look at the camera. Look at this. I presume these are Italian female celebrities. Yeah. Big interview here. It's chaos. Now here is 
a very, very old Alfa Romeo. Alfa Romeo. Here's Simon Kitson interviewing. Yeah, I think you'll find the braking is more a case of retardation rather than actually stopping in a hurry. I can just translate that for the public. Caspar, qui è il vincitore della classe LM più due alla 24 ore della mano. Power to the people. This kid's got it all. You know, it's got all the posing. It even sounds like a Porsche. Look at this. The pose. All the cameras. And the kid has just got the perfect poise. And here's the Lancia. The Bugatti. BMW is making another stab at it. Another group of cars. An OM. An Oscar. Alfa Romeo. And a marvelous Seattle, which either has a Fiat engine or a Crosley engine in it. Alfa Romeo and another very large Alfa Romeo touring body convertible. This is the plaza which originally staged the Mille Miglia. Lots of excitement, lots of media activity. These people are ready. At least their helmets are ready. Well, BMW is making another try and they got this far now. This one's ready for the road. I don't know about the rain. A rally. Oscar. BNC. Here's the MCs. Bentley, Oscar, at the Miller Minute. Ermini, Jaguar, Alfa Romeo, Zagato Alfa Romeo. Oscar. Well, here's BMW again trying. Oh, look at this Ferrari. As you notice, it started to rain. Well, the windshield wipers work. Top isn't there. BMW. A cheesy Italia coming up. Fiat. Behind it, look at the weatherproofing. Vignali Ferrari and a Giannini with convertible top. An OM. Returning to Brescia. Fiat 1100. Here's a very good car for this year's Mille Miglia. Umbrellas are in order. Now here comes a Porsche contingent. Lambda. Atavu. Maserati. Whoa. Look at this one. Wicked. This is spectacular. Fiat V8. Okay. And we got a Ferrari here. Vignali Ferrari. And we got another Vignali Ferrari here. And a very, very old Maserati. Probably 47 or 48. And a D-type. Ah, oh, Fiat, I was told. Emilia. Hmm? 
Dodge Aurelia. Mercedes. Mercedes. Again. Alright, here's the launch here. I guess a little. Fiat. Saab, Jaguar, Mercedes, contrasting vehicles, Mercedes and a Fiat. Brave man, no bumpers. I think they're being practical. <laughs> Emil car. The French car. No, this is not a 42 Chevy. I think it's a Peugeot of some vintage. Uh, here's a uh, Riley. And a Stang, I believe. And another Auto Vu or Fiat V8. Now, here's a whole group together. I think these are party crashers. They're not in the Millimilia. This is a Riley. Alva supercharged. Look at this car. This is a study in engineering here. Alvis. Oh, he's leaking a little uh, <clears throat> fluid there. Magnificent. Look at look at the plastic on the seats. I mean, this is original. What a car. Alfa Romeo. And another Alfa Romeo. 100th anniversary of Alfa Romeo, you remember? Another red Aston Martin. Oscar, but she's Italian. Mercedes Benz, Mexico. Here is Jackie Stewart. Jaguars. C-type. D-type. A Talbo. A Veritas. A Fiat Aerodynamica. It's a Seattle. Maserati Coupe. Rua body. Maserati. OM. Abar. Double bubble. Here's that kid again. It's colorful and it's crowded. Bristol. Man, it is a mob scene here. There's a Ferrari uh, Mille Miglia. Alright, here's some more car, Maserati. Healy, Silverstone. Beautiful Alaska. Aston Martin. Another red Aston Martin. And hey, look at here. MGs with millimillion numbers on them. Maybe they really did race at one time in the millimillia as those numbers. 1956, these two MGs raced in the millimillia. That's a Seata. Mexican road race Asuka. I mean, it is really. Uh, a ripple body. Interesting. And here's another Aston Martin, a newer one. Racing green. Aston Martin. 
and a Bugatti. Very nice. Maserati, I think they just stopped because they had to wait so long. You got a Ferrari here. Look at this beautiful. And with all that, look what you got here. You got one of these, another one of these rebel cars. Incredible. Look at the steering wheel. You just start hanging on the side when you take it off and get out. Wait a minute. He just opened the hood and look at this tiny engine and all this noise. Sorry, right, back to the office for the supercharger. The engine is now open. All right, here is the new. Ferrari Italia. They'll be common in a year or so, but right now, very unique car to see. Now, here's a Porsche getting a royal treatment arrival here. All right, more cars arriving. Nash Healy. All right, here's the next group of cars. There's a Vignali Ferrari, a Bugatti. Oh, a little Italian job. Cheese Italia. Ferrari. Four cylinder. More Ferraris and coming up and a Fiat Aerodynamica here. And this beautiful Vignali. Le Mans. Incredible. Incredible. Tell me. Volkswagen. Bugatti. Another Ferrari. And a Maserati. There's a Ferrari uh, Mille Miglia. Oh, and here's that Jack McAfee Paravano Ferrari that raced in the Mexican road race. It's a 330. Incredible. Unreal. Spectacular. Boy, you don't see something like this too, too often. Again, contrast. Oh, this is so much fun. Mille Mille Ferrari. Here is the uh, Marzotto Brothers Ferrari. Lancia. Mille Miglia. Ermini. This is the car. A little bit of cheese ain't bad. What? What a show! OM. Look at the uh, detail here. Maserati. Here comes. How you doing? This is the one that was stolen in the year 2002. Italy. Mille Miglia. Wow. Alfa Romeo. Corrado Lopesto.
Have a good drive, you guys. Bye. Zoto engine is open. This is so straightforward and honest. Austin Healy. Razor Nash. Bugatti. Cooper Jaguar. And the little boy. He is going to be a great mill and melee driver someday. And now the crowds just enjoy the cars in the afternoon. And there's a lot of enjoyment to be had. Now here's one of those little Fiat derivations we didn't get to see much of. Huh? Still hard to view. All of a sudden, <laughs> the crowd parted and the car is visible. And the crowds enjoy. In front of the Duomo. Maserati. Shot a bright new color. Italy. Mille Emilia. Alfa Romeo. Is this luscious enough? Alfa Romeo. I don't know if it was purposeful or not, but look at these soft color cars all along here. Greens, metallic blues. Very interesting. It's just a coincidence, I'm sure. Everybody's taking a picture of this Lagonda, right? It's the hood ornament, not the car. The car is pretty nice, though. This new uh, formatted Milamelia really gives a chance for people to enjoy their cars. Turned out to be a really nice day. The Maserati is pretty nice, too. Fourteen hundred. That was built. It's a pre-war car. Yeah, for me. Now we're in the original square of the Millimilia, the Piazza Victoria. We're ready to leave. Topolino, Fiat, the Ferrari. Yeah. Now the Ferrari parade and the Ferrari display is down here on this other street in Brescia. Oh, look at this now. Here's some atmosphere. Here is atmosphere. Ferrari atmosphere. Any kind of atmosphere. Marvelous. And just casually parked here on the curb is Steve McQueen's X250 uh, Luso. This Ferrari display is fantastic and in the location you can't beat some other great displays it's quite a display here's one of the new Italias in the most luscious green you've ever seen fantastic car this Ferrari display is spectacular. It's pretty hard to resist taking a picture of all these Ferraris. Back to the older ones now. Here's that Marzotto Brothers Ferrari again. Now up close and personal. Headed out for a man. Unbelievable. Now here's a very, very old Fiat. The racer's Ferrari. It's time for the start. God, listen to this. 250, oh, milli, milli, oh, here we go. Have a good trip. Oh. Get ready.
ready for the the night drive. Okay, we're at the start, and they're launching the Ferraris this year. Chaos runs supreme. These are cars they're going to queue up for the old car start lost in town. Dyson for. This is unbelievable. Yeah. We'll explain to Mill Amelia someday. Now again, these are the Ferraris that are leaving before the older cars. Now here's a Daytona. Whoa. A Dino. It's bumper to bumper traffic. Downtown Brescia. Alvis. There's not enough time in this video to explain what has happened. All right, some of the Ferraris are hot. F50. The traffic jam still ensues. Wait to queue up. Here. Okay, all that nonsense beside. Here is the real start, the Milli Milli, the older cars. And here's a Bugatti, for instance. They're facing the sun, boy, I tell you. Bugatti. Another Bugatti. No hands. Though. They come around the turn and they're stopped right away through one of the timed portions. I think it's bad. Here's the problem you have. These cars are hot. And they're having to sit here on a hill. It's an Alfa Romeo lineup here. More Alphas here than you'll probably have at the celebration. We got a, a terrible Alfa traffic jam here. You saw the car just come down the ramp. That's a traditional start. They come up here and go into town and then they leave. Delage. Little Fiat. She's Italian. She's Italian. Another cheese Italian. Alphas, alphas. Reading in the street. Believe it. The traffic jam ensues. in the crowd. Oh 
Okay, after all that nonsense, <laughs> the start, we're in the town of Spoleto. Ferraris are here, so they're going to evidently use this as a lead car before the older cars get here. So when they mean Ferraris, they mean Ferraris. Big ones, expensive ones. Coming into the square here. And they just keep coming and coming. All kinds. This is a Ferrari tribute this year. This is James Colbert's Ferrari that sold for a lot to a person in, the, in England. And this is Steve McQueen's Ferrari. So Colbert and McQueen's cars come together here in, in Italy. Ferrari Nirvana. All right, another Enzo behind. Let's hear it. Historic and vintage cars, well, they're coming into Spoleto. That's where we are. And they're lining up in some procedure to come through town. It's going to be dramatic. All right, here they come. Get ready. Okay, we're going to have a little ceremony here because OM was the first winner of the Mille Amelia and always uh, it's led by that kind of car. This, this is an OM, that one there, and on down. And this is an OM as well, but look what's happening down the street. The Bugattis are coming. All right, here's the first one, an OM Superba. It won the first Mille Amelia, or the OM did. And away it goes. All right. All right, the next OM. Another OM. OM stands for? OM. Mechanica is one of the words. I like this one. This is a little newer, it's kind of streamlined, and sexy. All right, this is an Amiel car. The Bugattis, they're ready. Look at them. They're ready to bounce. They're on their cell phones. Absolutely the best. More Bugattis. Unbelievable. <laughs> Another Bugatti. Oh, an Alpha here. Uh -oh, uh oh. Hey, Mark. Mark. Oh, this is this Fiat. Lancia. Oh, Mercedes. Hey, who's ever watching this, I'm excited. This is fun. Fiat. 
the power, the authority. Look at it. Austin Martin, now for Mayo. It's like a swarming. Look at it. Look at it. It's unbelievable. Alfa Romeo. Oh, I see a streamlined car coming up. See a cheesy tie back there? The oldies are getting in here, but see that shiny body? This is unbelievable. Look at it. Look at it. This is Spoleto. It's just too much. Just too much. Just enough. <laughs> this is the greatest ball. <laughs> you just run and run and run. Unbelievable. They're like bees, they're swarming. Alpha Romeo. Alpha Romeo. Aston Martin. How many cars have you seen that are historic, this together in one place? That's why the Mille Mille is incredible. There's a couple of drivers talking, though, sharing stories. Riley. Now BMW is coming. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. Here's that 328 with the interesting top. Now here's one of the... Um, Historic ones here from the museum. Coming on the inside down there are the other BMW. Notice they're all traveling together. More BMWs. This gentleman looks like he'd like to have it come to an end. Looking like a Ferrari, but it's not. We saw this last night. It's a Fiat. Yakum, hello. Yakum Moss, Mercedes. Another Mercedes. Whoa, look at this Mercedes. He means it. Scott, <laughs> you'll remember this. <laughs> This is Paletto to remind you. Hey, incidentally, look at the name of this place. I don't know. Veritas of Veritas. Frazier Nash. She's Italia. Yeah. Ferrari. Sierra. Aravu. She's Italian. Big Alpha here. Aston Martin. Aston Martin and Ferrari. Another Ferrari, the green one. 
Another Ferrari. Boy, they're really um, going slow here. I think the wet streets is all of a sudden started to rain again. Maserati. Hey, a beetle with an oval window. Split window. Corrado! <laughs> we know him. That's fabulous. For a moment, let's just look in some countryside of Umbria outside of Spoleto here. Maserati, one of the older models. Ooh, not sounding too good. Topolino! Ermini. Gary Bartlett. Hey, Gary! Lancia Aurelia. Oscar. Maserati. C type Jaguar. And here's the 1951 winner of the uh, Lamelia. Struggling. Miller Millie Ferrari. Seattle. Boy, the Porsches are coming. Maserati. In the afternoon traffic. Aggressive here. One more view of the countryside. Well, here's the Ferrari, the uh, Marzo, Marzotto Brothers Ferrari. That's running pretty good. Oscar. damage. The town of Spoleto and the Roman bridge in the background. One lone Ferrari. Huh. All right, the city of Spoleto, the Roman bridge, here comes the Talbo. Not running too well. Oh boy, busy road. Ferrari. The Roman Bridge, the town of Spoleto, and a Ferrari. When you're here, if you find a used car, what do you do? Want it. Well, the reality of the Millimilia, okay? Traffic jam. Note the background, though. Note the church in the background. One of the stragglers. One of the town. Well, the Jaguars are hanging on here. And we got a C-Type ready to go. Oh, look at the Maserati just came in. Get 
It's been stamped. There they go. Another. Oh, these guys, these guys are in a hurry. Give me your tired, your weary. Four cylinder Ferrari here. Club Italia. That's Eric. Whoa, look at that. Bunch of school kids. All right, here is the uh, racer's Ferrari. Boy, it's going to be a long drive to Rome tonight. This old We're in the town of Pienza, Saturday morning. Checkpoint. This is one of the checkpoints, so they move through here slowly. This is a really charming town. Police escort. Red Aston Martins, here in Italy. Reception is very warm, as you can see. All the Alfa Romeos. Another Alfa Romeo. Another Alfa Romeo. <laughs> Don't you love this? Fiat. This is the true Mille Miglia. I mean, they, they're going to go out on the road in a little while and really go at it. So, hey, Mark, Mark. OM. More Alfa Romeo. Bentley, Alpha. It's great Alpha here. And a lumbering Mercedes. More Alfa Romeo. Look at this one. <laughs> Bells are ringing. Little Fiat here. Alfa Romeo. Now let's look at one of the nice buildings here. Springtime. Here is the cathedral here in Pienza. Riley. Another Alfa. Eight cylinder. Via del Amore. Alancia. BMW. I love Italy. Let's look at the countryside that that car just came from. We're in Tuscany. And there he goes through town. Alfa Romeo. Fiat. Okay, here. 
escorted. Escorted by the police. BMW. One of the oldies. OM. Pienza. Countryside. Pienza. Aston Martin. Anna. Maritas. The Tustin countryside. And Italian cars. And Pienza again. OM. I think this is a Seattle. It's very small. Ermini. She's Italian. Fiat V8, auto vu. It's Italia. These guys you see in the Millimilia all the time. They they just sort of tour it. They're not in the Millimilia, right? Pinard. Well, the poppies are out, and here's a Maserati in the springtime. Fiatta. So we got to get well. Mercedes sponsored this event. Got to give them some uh, due here. Right, here's that uh, Lancia. All right, amongst all the publicity cars here, there is a Ferrari. Right here, and he's in a traffic jam. Ferrari. Whoa. Oh, here's that Ferrari, the, the Zoda Brothers. Now we got the Mexico Ferrari, the Jack McAfee one here. One twenty and a C type. She's Italia. The town of Pienza, the olive trees, and an Alfa Romeo. She's Italia. Another Ferrari. Launch Aurelia. one's a Maserati. Not moving very quickly. Oh, look at the Mercedes here. Blind turn. The was ahead of him, though. War 
more passing going on. C-type Jaguar. I think I can, I think I can. Now watch this. The countryside here is absolutely beautiful. Watch ya, Alpha Mayo. convention here. Look at this. Two Oscars. Austin Healy. Load of pigs. Aston Martin. AC Maserati I can't resist one more opportunity to show Tuscany at its finest and that road right there in the center now is the road they came from to this town Ponte Aurelius ah, Another C-type. This is that really delicate corner <laughs> Delicate, I say. They always get it in the wrong gear and lug it up the hill. All right. Come on. Yeah, let's get it up the hill here now. No, this is a... What is Maserati? Boy. What the who? Yeah, you gotta go up the hill. Here's Corrado the Pistol. Boy, it's Ferrari. Here's a Ferrari. And a Cooper. What a way to end the video, huh?